last long in the memory. Today is an idyllic seaside town, but in the 1950s it was the scene of the worst flooding in post-war Britain. These floods claimed many lives and ripped the community apart. initially denied 
indeed these experiments were taking place. But in 2001, new documents and RAF logbooks were uncovered, along with an interview with a pilot carrying out the experiments further inland. The interview makes fascinating listening. We'd assembled at Cranfield in Bedfordshire in mid-August 1952, studying clouds. There was no disguising the fact that the seedsman had said he'd make it rain, and he did. The combined enterprise had attracted a lot of attention. The BBC television unit had visited us to make a film and to explain the probable advantages to the world of a controlled rainfall. The day before the programme was due, the rain fell with unprecedented vigour and washed Lynmouth into the sea. The programme was never broadcast, and no link was ever proven between these two events. But it's not the only question about the floods which remains unanswered. 